search for a suspect after a child is critically hurt in a hit and run accident in East Harlem. CBS News Elijah Westbrook live at the scene this morning with a look at the person police are now looking for. Elijah. That's right. Well, Chris and Cindy, according to police, that six year old, as you mentioned, is in critical condition at the hospital fighting for his life after being struck inside this park here. This is the Thomas Jefferson Park here in East Harlem. We know this uh, matter happened around uh, on 111th Street uh, near First Avenue. Go ahead and take a look at some images that we were able to uh, gather from the NYPD of the person they are currently looking for at this hour. Uh, he was last seen uh, wearing a black hooded sweatshirt and light pants. Uh, the two wheeled motor motorized vehicle that was involved in the incident appears to uh, be shown in these images. Uh, now, police say they were called uh, again to this park here on 111th Street and 1st Avenue after the suspect of uh, riding that two wheeler struck the little boy on the sidewalk. Uh, we're being told the kid was thrown to the ground and suffered severe head trauma, including brain bleeding and multiple skull fractures. Right now, that child remains in critical condition at New York Presbyterian. One woman we spoke with after the hit and run says it was a sad situation to see play out. I just seen them trying to put him inside the ambulance. I don't know if I got here at the last minute. It was sad because the mom really, the parents is going crazy. I don't know. I can't say what they were calling because it's a little baby. Now, investigators say the suspect fled the scene before officers arrived. They believe he left heading northbound in the park towards 114th Street and Pleasant Avenue. This incident is being investigated by the NYPD's Highway Collision Investigation Squad. Anyone with information is being urged to give police a call. And that's the very latest here in East Harlem. Elijah Westbrook, CBS 2 News. Elijah, thank you.